2300 years ago, the Mayan were known as masters of the sky and astronomy. Their research led to the creation of a timekeeping system known as the Long Count Calendar, a system incredibly precise that it pinpoints numerous events up to present day and beyond. Although his theories are often misinterpreted, prophesizer Nostradamus was capable of predicting such events as well. Mysteriously, the Mayan calendar has an abrupt ending, which was later summarized in the Mayan sacred tree. The tree of events entail a crossing point of the ecliptic band of the Milky Way. Essentially, the stoppage of the Mayan long count calendar coincides with the very rare alignment between the Earth, the Sun, and the entire galaxy. There will be a winter solstice, but unlike any other solstice, the Sun will align with the ecliptic and the galactic equator. The galactic equator is an imaginary line that marks the center of the Milky Way galaxy. In conjunction with the alignment is the day that the Earth completes a full wobble, known as the Great Year, which takes about 26,000 years to complete. These events will also have a major effect on the ocean conveyor belt due to the fact that there will be an intense increase of solar maximum, said by NASA to be 50% stronger than ever before. Similarities include the sci-fi movie, The Day After Tomorrow, in which the conveyor belt completely stopped. This is the end of the age of Pisces, and beginning the age of Aquarius. The mind wrote this abrupt ending as a sacred doorway to the underworld, a human being's entrance into life and death, the crossroads of destiny. The Mayan were surprisingly intelligent to calculate such cosmic events with their time. They centered their whole culture around these events. Was it all only meant to be a joke? What will really happen on this day? Time will tell.